I had to sneak out from Buddy. Um, so I wanted to come out. It does feel like it's starting to drizzle. Puppy just ran right into me. Um, the wind has slowed down. Um, that might not be a great thing because sometimes that could mean that the storm is intensifying and coming more this direction. But we've had some extreme wind gusts here. Um, I wouldn't even be afraid to say we've had 70 mile per hour winds at points. But uh, anyway, here's the clouds. Um, a friend of mine, well, I don't know what's going on with this light out here. A friend of mine wanted me to show her a tree outside the house because I did it inside the house. Um, hopefully y'all can see it. And that busy road again. But the clouds over here is even worse. Let me show you. So, I'm hoping we don't get no one of these tornadoes. But, y'all see how bad these clouds are? And they are moving. They're rolling. These clouds are rolling. And, and uh, Mr. B said this is a humongous storm. Um, and over there looks like it could possibly be a tornadic type cloud. But I'll hold still for a minute and see if y'all can notice how fast these clouds are going. These are definitely looking like some tornadic type clouds here. No doubt. Let's, let's, no, not. Like I said, I'm be picking up again. It's not like it was. Because we had pretty much um, steady wheat. Like 50 miles an hour. And us, going to tip over. But I have the door to the house right here out my RV door. So, I mean, like, I can run pretty quick. I mean, like, my RV door is right there and the house door is right there. And there's a hallway in between the bathroom and another room. So, at least I have some place that I can run my pets. I may even end up putting my pets in the house ahead of time just to make it easier, hard enough for us to run on our own. Maybe like I said, putting the pets in the house in one of the rooms and keeping them in there until this storm passes might be a good idea. <sighs> but, yeah, I just wanted to show y'all. Like I said, um, if y'all are interested in Mr. MBB333, um, is doing a live on this weather in North and South Carolina, Georgia, um, even Florida, um, you know, probably later on going to be Virginia, but, uh, yeah, and we just had a tornado in Laura, South Carolina, um, not so long ago, um, and I'm kind of in between there and Myrtle Beach, so... Of course, y'all know, because I have stalkers, I can't give you the exact location, 
But y'all do know that I'm on the coast. And, uh... Like I said, there's several different towns in between Loris and Little Beach. And off to the side of those. So... Sometimes I'll post that I'm in Laura, sometimes I'll post I'm in Modal Beach, when actually I'm in neither one of those. <laughs> but, like I said, due to stalkers trying to get my location, another wind gust. I had, um, I had limbs. Now there's one there. There's limbs everywhere here. Um, but as you can see, there's my RV door, and there's the house door. So y'all, I've got like five steps to take, and I'm in the house. So, but yeah, I see all these limbs here. I pulled a lot of these off of my car. Um, that's from the really high winds earlier today. Some over here, there's Radar and Puppy. Chapman Ham. Got the cage there. But like I said, I might have to go ahead and put that in the house. My trash can blew over. I didn't bother to pick it up. for a minute and let's see if y'all can hear this ring. Well, I you probably hear as far as it's not as heavy as it was earlier. goes a little bit there, but like I said, it's not, the wind's not as heavy as what it would be at one now. But it's not near as heavy as it was since early this morning um, into this afternoon. But I wanted to let y'all know I was okay and do an update and I, I want to thank all of you for your prayers and your wishes well wishes uh, and for all your support and puppy is trying to pull the blankets oh, sorry y'all I gotta get him puppy no 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 okay hold on y'all I gotta get him because if he pulls the blankets out then they won't have anything to lay on to keep them warm. So let me try it. All right, y'all. I'm gonna let these go so I can get these back. Right, y'all. Listen at this wind. It just picked up a little bit. This is what we've been dealing with all freaking day. Oh my God, it almost felt like a tornado was coming by. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, let's get her doggy. Buddy, in the house. No matter what you gotta do, puppy, leave him alone. Trace, you need to put him in the house. I mean, the wind's picking up. The weather's getting worse. Huh. Yeah. raining here soon or something. But, I don't know, this lighting's not real good on here. Um, Lord. Yeah, they need to get the animals in the house because it's fixing to start raising cane, I believe. Look at them clouds just rolling. Now, y'all seen and heard that wind. It's been non-stop all day like that. 
Alright, I'm going over to my daughter's to get some tacos. And I better get back in the house. Before this hell breaks loose here. Oh my god, yeah, I don't know what that is back there, but I hope that's nothing. Because it sure looks be tight. Alright. Okay, everybody, it's 524. Uh, I came out to give y'all an update. We are under a tornado watch, which means that it's favorable. Um, the storm is now starting to come over my area. It was upper NC in South Carolina. It is drizzling now. Um, you can plainly see these clouds don't look like they're nice clouds. There has been some awful like I said, all day long, and it's supposed to get worse. There's a, what I call a hook cloud. Do you see that? The tail came down, but it just, well, you can still see the tail. You see that? It's a, what I call a hook echo. And let me see if I can zoom in on this. And what happens is the tail drops out, and it curls around, and it goes up inside the cloud, and that's then produces a tornado. Um, but you can plainly see that these are definitely fast moving. Um, it said the storm will be out of here by say 11 o'clock tonight. Um, 11 p.m. it will at least start calming down. Uh, you can see how fast it's moving. We have the dogs and water and everything that we might need in case one does hit in the house. Um, there are inside walls. We have no basement, of course, we're on the coast. But there are inside walls. And, and, and you can see this house, y'all, is block. I mean, I'm not saying it's thick block, but it is block. So, <laughs> thank God for a place to go on. And you know, I have that one room, it's all cleaned up, we got a microwave in there, we got, a, you know, stuff in there. But, we eat dinner, my daughter made some homemade tacos, Mexican tacos, homemade, she makes the tacos too with mezza, and she makes her own salsa, and uh, so we had that, so we have eaten dinner, and like I said, we are, we got the house ready. Um, with everyone so far is inside it except for me. Um, but like I said, my door and the house door is like so close that the minute I hear the warning, I can run in. Um, it, it's like I said, it's drizzling. I have a strong feeling it's going to start raining even heavier. But I'll try to give you all an update this evening when this thing passes. Um, yeah, see, um, these hook clouds that's moving fast, they come down, they spin, and then the little tail goes up in it, and then it, normally a tornado might drop out. You never know. There has been um, what they also call down drafts. Um, I, okay, I don't want to get rain. It's starting to rain heavier, and I don't want to get rain in my phone because it messed it up the last time. All right, y'all. I'll keep you up to date. Y'all have a good night.